Hey, this is Steve with Real-Time Music Solutions. Today, we're going to look at setting up RMS Coach as an RMS creator. First, let's go to www.rms.biz. Next, find RMS Coach on the page and click Download. Here you'll see our announcement for Rehearsal Live Share. Scroll down. This is going to go over the minimum tech specs for RLS and you can install for Mac or Windows. I'm on a Mac. You can find the installer in your downloads folder. Go ahead and open it up. Welcome to the RMS Coach installer. This process will install the necessary components to run RMS Coach on your computer. Click Next. Accept the agreement. Click Next. RMS Coach may be used with licensed musical theater content prepared by RMS or with your own content prepared through the RMS Creator platform. Please make a selection from the following options. RMS prepared content, that would be Oklahoma, Sound of Music, etc., or your own content. In this video, we're going over custom content, so we'll click your own. Next. One more question. Since you'll be using custom content, we need to know if you are the one creating the content or if you'll be using content someone created for you. Please make a selection from the options below. I am a creator today. Click Next. Thanks for using RMS Coach together with RMS Creator. This installation will skip over the step of loading an RMS prepared show. Instead, it will look to you to supply your own MIDI data when you launch RMS Coach for the first time. And here we have a couple of links. RMS Creator information, a whole page dedicated to being an RMS Creator and how to create content and how to share content with many links and video tutorials. And we have a specific link to building your first show, which we're going to go over in this video. Click Next. Installer is now ready to begin. Please note, if you're planning to work with an RMS prepared musical theater title, there are three parts to the process. But for the creator, step two is skipped. We're going to install RMS Coach and then install the sounds needed to run your show. Click Next. The installer will automatically bring you to RMS Sample Sync, which manages the audio sample library used by RMS products on your computer. Click Continue. Update from Internet. Continue. Okay, so after a quick check of the drive against the server, we see the files we need to download. Let's click Continue. Depending on your internet connection, this could be very quick or take a few minutes. Update complete. Your sample library was successfully updated. Click quit. Completing the RMS Coach installer. RMS Coach should now be ready to go on your computer. Be sure to visit rms.biz for more information and please don't hesitate to contact us. Click finish. So now we've installed RMS Coach. We can see we have an icon on our desktop. We're going to go ahead and open it up. Okay, there's no show data to load because we skipped getting licensed material in place during the install. It's relying on our own original content. So, let's go ahead and build original show. This utility creates a custom show file with MIDI files. A custom show file may be shared with other users and exported for use on mobile devices with RMS Mix. If you don't have your MIDI files together yet, not a worry. You can go ahead and click cancel and come back to this video when you're ready. I, however, do have MIDI prepared, so I'm going to click Next. Here we can log in if we have a Facebook account or a Gmail account, or we can log in with email. We see here a sign up option to create a specific account for RMS. I'm going to go ahead and do that. Okay, RMS Coach wants to use accounts.rms.biz to sign in. Excellent. Click Continue. All right, basic form. Go ahead and fill this out. Okay, after filling out the information, click Sign Up. If you're on Mac, you may be asked for your computer's password at this point. If you're on Windows, you won't. Successful login. Please return to your app. Go back to Coach. Your sign-in was successful. Great. Okay, and now we can build our first show. Please enter a show name. Go ahead and call it First Show. Next, please add MIDI files. Go ahead and hit the plus button here. 
and you'll see that I've done this in the past so it knows where to look for the MIDI files on my computer but for you it will start you maybe at your desktop or documents folder and you can just navigate on your hard drive to find the MIDI files that you want to upload into our software. So I'm going to go ahead and select a few. Open. If I decided I wanted to remove some, I could just highlight and click the minus button. If I wanted to add more to this, I could click add. I'll go ahead and click next. First show is successfully created. To make this content available to others via the RMS Cloud, click the share show data button. Okay. Ah, I'm not a subscriber yet. If you would like to share this content with other people, you'll need to subscribe to one of our plans. For now, you can use the content locally to test it out and see how our software works. Okay, we see here that our first show is in place with our MIDI files. First show, we are logged in. After you've used the content locally, you may decide that you would like to subscribe or at least test it out in a free trial. You can click your name at the top here. Uh, this will be your account name. Visit my account. Okay, I'm automatically brought to my account, accounts.rms.biz. We're signed in to the new account I've created. I can click here and click settings. I can link social networks and I can scroll on down to subscription. Get more by upgrading your account. Get more info. And as you can see here, we have our subscription plans. Either one, you can go ahead and click subscribe now and you will be asked for some credit card information. You can fill that out and two weeks later you'll be charged for the first time. So at this point we've downloaded RMS Coach, installed it, created an account, created our first show, and started our subscription. Now you probably want to share this content with other people and begin a rehearsal live share session. Here's how. Okay, so we are back in RMS Coach. We still have this first show loaded. I am officially a subscriber, and I want to share the data to the cloud and get it into the hands of my cast or students. I'm going to click Tools, Share Show Data. Please enter a brief description to help identify this show. I'm going to stick with the same name for show. I'm going to add a one, and the reason I do this is maybe I get this on the cloud, my students get it, and then I realize, oh, you know what, I want to add more songs to this. I want to remove songs. I want to make tempo changes or key changes. I could do that and then upload it as a new show, but still a part of the booking. And I could call it First Show, Overture Faster, First Show, Finale, Down Half Step, making it easier to differentiate between different versions. So let's go ahead and click Next. Your show is successfully uploaded. You can manage sharing options by visiting your account. Let's go ahead and do that now. Visit my account. Now here, notice that there are two entries for this first show. One has this music stand symbol and the other has this play symbol. The music stand symbol is indicative of RMS Coach, the program that we just used to upload from. As a creator, you also have access to RMS Mix, uh, which will allow you to take your content and send it out to smartphones. Um, right now, we're just looking at RMS Coach. So go ahead and click on this title. We can see it here, first show. Now, click Unlock Instructions. Okay, RMS Coach booking information, first show. Thanks for using RMS Coach. You can set up your access to this booking by clicking the access link below. So here we have the access link. This is most important. This is the way you're going to share your content. You can right click and copy. You can go here and copy this. You're gonna send this out in an email to your cast. If you send out your specific access link and the participant install video, which I'm gonna go ahead and link below in the description, that's all your cast needs to get your content and begin rehearsing. After that, you'll be able to come here, go to Tools, click Live Share, and invite them into a rehearsal live share session, provided they have Coach open and an active internet connection. Thanks for watching.